Don'ts may include some medicines and procedures that do not meet the need of, that do not meet the need for services that can be insured against. Most um, the most common exclusions are the cosmetic procedures, food supplements, and elective procedures. Then there is an um, other thing to consider is the claim process. The simpler the claim process, the faster the settlement of the claim. So when you are looking for a health insurance cover, one of the things to consider for your claims to be smooth is a good customer support, which is an additional advantage when you are looking for a medical cover. Then there is um, waiting periods. Uh, when buying uh, health insurance, it's important to note that not all ailments or illnesses are covered immediately. You need to serve a specified waiting period to get certain coverages. So we have uh, different types of waiting periods. There's an initial waiting period that's immediately you pay for the cover. There's a time you're supposed to wait for the policy document and the card to be processed, processed for you to be able to access treatment for the first time. Then there is a pre-existing condition waiting period. One, the waiting, the pre-existing condition are the illnesses that a customer is suffering prior to buying the health insurance and must be disclosed. And um, some of these conditions are the hypertension, diabetes, mostly they are the long-term diseases. Uh, but the good news is that uh, most of the insurance companies have now come up with products with minimal waiting period because we'll find for pre-existing condition, some have three months waiting period, one year, some even have two years waiting period. This means if you have a condition and you're getting the cover, you'll have to wait for the three months, one year, or even the two years for you to be able to use the cover to cover that illness. Then there is a list of providers. Uh, with the insurance, it allows you to access cashless treatment. But if you go to a hospital, which is not in the list of providers, for that insurance company, you'll have to pay for your bills from your own pocket and claim later. And this might be a lengthy process. So when buying the insurance, you should check if there is um, an hospital near you because you might have an emergency which you can't go far and you'll need treatment and that you might be forced to pay from your pocket. Then there is a copay. Uh, what the copay entails is that each time you visit a health facility, you'll have to pay a fixed amount to the hospital. And then the specific amount varies from hospitals the insurance company and also varies according to a specific policy. And the goal of copayment is to discourage a necessary visit for healthcare institutions under outpatient service. Any question up to there? Okay, uh, I'll continue. So uh, I'll uh, discuss with you on some of the things we've done to solve the law insurance uptake. One is that uh, we've uh, innovated products that uh, enable friends to come together and contribute towards premium. You all know that in Kenya, uh, we live as a community. And the insurance in Kenya only allows you to insure your immediate family, that's a nuclear family. But as this much, we have come up with a product that enables you to share cover with your friends or even your chama or your extended family, that's your brothers and sisters. Uh, we've also encouraged the um, Diaspora remittance where people abroad can be able to pay for their extended families covers back at home to avoid the stress of 
contributing money in groups to take care of hospital bills. We also have the access to quality healthcare in the middle level hospitals with an option for top level hospitals in the event that you need a specialized treatment. Then there's the painless payment where we've introduced uh, affordable products that you can pay in small bits. So I'll introduce some of our products to you. We have um, three products. The first product is called the Afia Smart Nabeste. The second one is called the Afia Smart Extended, which has uh, three options. That's the bronze, silver, and gold. Then there's the seniors for people above 65 years and above. So the Afia Smart Nabeste, it takes uh, up to a maximum of six people. And you can, as you can see on my screen, these are the benefits. So for Afia Smart Nabeste, the maximum number is six people. So if you are up to four people, you pay 22,000. And if you want to be the maximum number, which is six, each person to top up a thousand shillings. Then for the Afia Smart Extended, the cover accommodates up to a maximum of 11 people sharing. So it can be a group of 11 people. You can take a single policy, which has, which can be the bronze, silver, and gold, then share the premium and the benefits. Then there is a senior's cover for the 65 years and above. For this cover, it can only accommodate two people maximum, and it has to be a couple. And then um, there is a six months waiting period for the pre-existing condition, unlike the other covers in the market, where you're supposed to wait for two years or one year for the person to be able to undergo treatment. So I'll take you through the onboarding and the claim process. Uh, for our products, you can access them online through the www.dsmart.co.ke. Uh, you'll be able to view various options, then select your option and pay premium. Also through the system, you're able to submit your KYC, that's the ID, that certificate, and the passport photos. So once you've provided all the documents and the information that you require, you'll be able to get the medical card within the nine to 10 days timeline. We only use e-card, but if the client would want to print the card, it's allowed, but at their own cost. Then once the client goes to the hospital, the client is supposed to show the card and an activation code is sent to the principal member phone number. So we advise clients that it's good to inform your principal member anytime you are going to the hospital so that they can be aware that there is a message that is coming because without the code, you cannot go undergo treatment using the cover. Then once the principal member confirms the code, authorization is done and the treatment will be administered. Any question up to there? Hi, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Could you kindly just go back a, a, a slide back and explain more on uh, group covers for institutions or companies? Okay, just a minute. Okay, for all the products, apart from the seniors, they are all fit for organizations. Like the Afia Smart Nabeste, it can accommodate a maximum of six people. The seats don't have to be related. It can be employees, extended family, or even friends. Then also the Afia Smart Extended, which entails the bronze, silver, and gold. It accommodates from one person to a maximum of 11 people sharing the cover. Not that for these covers, we only count lives, not the adults. So if it, if it can be a principal, spouse, and two kids, or principal with three kids, yeah, just an example. So it accommodates up to a maximum of 11 people. Okay. Uh, so for, for example, if, if I take, for example, the, the gold one, mm -hmm. and, and you say it takes up to a maximum of 11 people. Yes. So uh, the 11 people pay 90,000 individually, or that is the, the amount the group pays? Uh, if you're taking gold, if you're 11, 
yes. uh, the premium will be 150,000. So the bigger the group, the higher the premium. The example I've given is up to four people. Oh, okay. Yeah, so for 11 people, the premium will be 150 per group, not per person. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I see. And then, uh, so uh, that IP stands for the maximum amount that can be spent? Inpatient. Oh, for, oh sorry, sorry, uh, inpatient and outpatient. So yeah. uh, does that inpatient cover the total amount the group spends or the total individual spends? Pardon? Uh, for example, uh, still on the gold, okay. uh, the, the patient cover is at 2,000. Yes. And the uh, patient is, is at 250. Yes. So does that 2, 000, the 2 million cover inpatient cover for the whole group or for an individual? Uh, for the whole group, the benefits are shared, except the last expense and maternity. If you look yeah. at the amount, it can only cover one person. So we, for maternity and last expense, we only cover one claim per year. One claim per year. Yes, but the rest they are all shared. There is no limitation. Like this person mm -hmm. has to use this amount. It's open oh. for the group to decide how they want to use the cover upon themselves. Okay. Yeah. And uh, if I move to institutional covers, do you have any? Because I think this slide shows now just um, maybe for families or a group. Do you have now for an institutional cover? It's the same. Okay. The rates and the benefits are the same. But if it's a big group, let's say of 100 people, we can always uh, work out the benefits you'd want and okay. give you the rate for the specified uh, benefits. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Well, uh, there's a question asking, in the chat box. Is, uh, Chege, Chege is asking, what is the max age for family to join? Uh, the maximum age for the for a principal member it's uh, 65 years. That's the uh, Afia Smart Nabeste and the Afia Smart Extended, but the dependents can be zero to 65. Then for people above 65, we have the seniors option. The seniors cover covers up from 65 years to 80 years maximum. Uh, Lillian is asking what's the agent commission for this product. So for the commission, for businesses below 1 million, we pay 5%. For business above 1 million, we pay 10% commission. Uh, Chege is asking for the panel list of hospitals. Okay. Uh, you can access the list of hospital on our website, or you can share your. We can share the list of hospitals via email. We have your email address, so we'll be able to share the panel of hospitals via email. Uh, someone is asking for seniors when they reach over eighty years that the cover sees. Yes. But that will depend on your. That will also depend on your claim ratio. We might consider for you to continue with the cover, but depending on your claim ratio. Thank you, Joanne. Uh, are you done with the presentation? Yes, I'm done. Okay. Uh, thank you very much, Joanne. And I believe uh, we all learned one or two things from the presentation Joanne has done, which was very informative. Uh, thank you for your questions. Thank you for attending the webinar. I will leave the session open for any question for the next, uh, let's say, two minutes, then we wind up the meeting. Dan, thank you for joining us and uh, thank you for your feedback. Thank you, Chege, as well, for your feedback and thank you for joining us as well. Thank you. Uh, first of all, I want to thank everybody for joining us. Uh, thank you for your time, and we hope that you that you uh, go on our Bismart website and see for yourself for yourselves how how it is. And yeah, okay, let's pray. Thank you, God, for giving us life and for making this webinar successful. We hope that everyone here uh, has a great day and. A productive one. Amen. Amen.
Thank you once again for joining us.